Hi, this is Songwriting 101. Song, how to use what we've learned in the previous videos, the 145 chord progression and the natural minor to create a bed, a musical bed for your lyrics, okay? Really good songs I just kind of hear in my head and figure out the chords, but you can do the chords first, and here's an example of what to do. So let's say you're gonna write a song in C major, right? So we're gonna put C and the natural partners, as you know from before, are F and G. Right, C, F, G. So let's write down C, F, and G. So let's also write down here uh, the natural minors. And maybe we'll, we'll use the natural minor in this song. So the natural minor of a C, hop back twice, is A minor. Natural partner of an F, hop back twice, is a D minor. The natural partner of a G, hop back twice, psh, psh, is an E minor. So, all of these chords should sound good together. They should sound like they fit. So let's just give that a shot. And let's just see if all these chords fit together. So here we go. So we have C, F, G. I'm just going to play them randomly, all right? Um, now I'm going to think about it. I'm going to look up there and pick a chord and play it. So here we go. We're going to start with the C because that's the number one. That's the family of chords, C, F, G and all their natural minors. These are like brothers and sisters, and these are like cousins, all right? So here we go. Starting on the C, and then we'll go somewhere else. I don't know, here we go. does sound like it fit together. Now I'll just call out the chord that I'm playing and uh, that way you can hear it and you'll know that they, they all fit. So here we go. So C. A minor. D minor. E minor. A minor. D minor. G. What the heck? Seven because we're going to change back to the C, F, G, C, F, G, and we'll go minor, A minor, D minor, E minor, G. G7, just to go back to the beginning, G7, C, C. So those chords fit together, right? They really fit together. And a lot of singer-songwriters use that formula. So here's a song. It starts with, it's in the family of C, so it starts in C. And then it goes to, instead of G, this person uses an E minor. And then instead of back to C, they use the natural A, <clears throat> a minor. Then they use G and F, all right? And you know this song. And uh, I'll just do a little bit so you can see how this works. And you don't need to use it in C, use it in any one, four, five you want. So here's here's this song. It's a really great song. C, E minor, A minor, G, F. That's the whole song. Ready? If you ever find yourself stuck in the middle of the sea, I say the word to find you goes on and it's not just for guitar and if you know this song you know that it's a Yuki song you can play it on anything so here we go C E minor A minor G F if you ever find yourself stuck in the middle of the C E minor A minor I'll say the world to find you all right so that's just one way you can come up with a nice a uh, musical bed to put lyrics on, to put a poem that you've written on top of, okay? So that is songwriting with the music first.